clean air. Um, get away from people that, uh, that aren't doing you any good. Even if it's going to the wrong side of the course, I just want clear air away from the slower boats that's going to slow me down. Sometimes it's just go for the wind, don't get a wind shadow, downwind. Stay out of trouble because <laughs> there's lots of boats coming by that uh, lots of different speeds and yeah, staying out of trouble has always worked for me. I think with this many boats on the same start line, you've got to be very assertive and get in the space and stick with it. I think the most important thing is to get your head out of the boat. Um, I definitely didn't do enough of that today. I had my head in the boat too much time away from the boat this winter. But uh, if I could get my head out the boat and look around a bit more, I probably would have gone better. You sell your own race. Sail as fast as you can at all times. Um, because the boats around you might be faster on one leg but then slower on the next. So it's really not about them, it's not about racing other boats, it's about racing yourself. How quickly can you get yourself? I think, I think a lot of it depends on what boat you're in. Um, but yeah, keeping clear wind uh, is always pretty key. Keeping clear of the other boats, not doing anything silly. And, uh, and thinking ahead to what's coming ahead of you when you've got a lot of boats going around the course. I think you've got to be super aware of the boats around you and whether or not you're quicker or they're quicker and sort of your motion relates quite a bit to that. I would say knowing how you compete against the other boats, as in how you are in the rankings, in the different wind conditions, to know where you are doing relative to them during the race. And then practicing in the conditions that you're optimum, I think is very important. You have to nail the start because and you've got to nail the start specifically to what type of boat you're in. If you're the fastest in the fleet, it's a little bit easier and you can just hold a lane, you'll be fine. Um, but if you're a slower boat than some, you need to have options because someone's going to roll you at some point and you can't lose your lane. 